Hello everybody, it's been a while, but I'm uh, I'm back at it again. Um, today we are doing a mini tournament with the Euro Trucks, and uh, it's for four uh, four rounds. Uh, we are racing with Stony, Marky, Matt KPV, and some other good drivers like Ludok. And uh, yeah, it's just been been fun. Uh, we had we had our fun. Uh, it has uh, been a while since we we started racing again online because uh, I never felt like it because, uh, we've been working a lot and uh, it has taken a toll on me I've been uh, pretty tired so yeah uh, anyway let's get into the, the qualifying here uh, we start on the first place uh, getting through the first corners really smooth and the thing is in this track on Renvort you gotta break really really hard in the first corner and then in this second corner you gotta tap the brake a bit so you get enough rotation to get through now this corner is just getting through cleanly uh, taking the right lines and here I go a bit wide and I spin out a bit so this will probably cost me uh, the P1 position because a lot in here will take definitely advantage of that so we do a 33.02 and Ludok, uh, who was actually uh, still uh, two places behind us, set uh, the fastest lap with a 32.9, so uh, which is very fast. And the time I lost there was probably just, uh, yeah, the spin, the spin roo. So yeah, this is uh, the starting position. He already gets one point, and let's get into the race. Renvert is uh, such a pretty track to race around. It's uh, really fun, and uh, since uh, since uh, White Fun Man got uh, did some fun stuff, he uh, he made some track circuits. He named the corners, and uh, if you want to check out his work, uh, I'll link his socials below. It's, he has some really awesome stuff, and uh, it's it's amazing what the community of Circuit Superstars does. So now we are getting into this race, already attacking Ludok, getting close, starting fights and uh, showing him that uh, I will have no mercy. But neither will he, he's uh, very good at defending as you will see in this tournament. Now we're just chasing him down, meanwhile Marky is right behind us, Matt KPV and uh, Stony I think are fighting in the back. We set the fastest lap here, but it's only the first lap, so it means nothing really. I'm getting through these corners, getting real tight and using all the track here. Uh, keeping our momentum. Still chasing Ladok and looking for an opportunity. And as I make the same mistake as I did in qualifying here. Uh, so I lost a bit of time there again. So we gotta get it back. Now chasing back into the third lap. We do a 33.1. And Ludog does a 32.999, which is pretty funny. And again, we are very quick through these corners. So this hairpin is really quick for us. So this might be the opportunity where I can overtake him. Um, or if he makes a mistake in these sections here. But waiting for a mistake is, is, yeah, is not the best strategy here. As I just drive through the bollard there. Uh, getting a penalty. It's actually a 1, not 2. Uh, that's a mistake of the game. Um, Ludo going a bit wide here in this turn, but he has the advantage now, so uh, we keep chasing. Keep gaining some time, but it's gonna be difficult to overtake him here on Renvort. Because Renvort is a very difficult track to overtake, uh, especially if you just drive cleanly and drive fast. Now getting through these corners, so maybe trying to set the fastest lap here. Um, at least we can get some extra points that uh, it would be useful at the end of the, the tournament. Uh, although it is just a fun tournament with some uh, really awesome guys. We just want to be competitive as always. And show everyone how fun racing can be when you're go also going fast. Now we do a 32.545 which is amazingly fast if you know uh, Ludog did a 32.9 in the qualifier which is also very quickly already and uh, yeah this is just a very fast lap for me I'm really happy I did that because you see how much the gap was close there um, but it doesn't matter 
we take P2, the dog takes P1, Mark in third, Matt KPV in fourth, and then uh, Stony and uh, the last guy finish as well. So the standings uh, now are the dog in first. Oh, it was Kick Quick. I forgot it was Kick Quick. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Kick Quick. Uh, yeah, so Ludok in first, per myself in second with the extra point and Ludok with the extra point of uh, qualifying and then Marky in third. As you guys already know, uh, we will now do a reverse grid because that's the standard thing to do here in uh, Circuit Superstars when you're doing mini tournaments. And uh, reverse grids are always a bit uh, tricky. So we need to look ahead as Minardi taught us. Look ahead to what's happening in front of you and uh, don't be too... Uh, courageous in the first laps but that second thought is uh, not what we do we already attack Marky in the first corner as it goes wide and already take a spot but Marky crashes here taking the dog out so uh, which is very unfortunate for him but we keep chasing Matt KPV now which he, who is defending his inside very well uh, just trying to keep up right here getting good lines uh, not really attacking because I know attacking those corners when you're a little bit behind is not that good. Um, and here, yeah, it was just a bit. I kind of cut the corner, but you know, it's just fun, some fun racing, and we all do that sometimes. Um, at least it doesn't give us a penalty, so the game allows it. And as long as the game allows this stuff like that and doesn't penalize you, we uh, we are okay. Now Matt KPV uh, kind of dive bombing us and now Stony, who was in front of us has a little bit of damage because you can see the smoke um, but he is still behind now Matt KPV. Here I need to, needed to break because uh, else I would have hit uh, Stony, and that would have ended badly there in the, the SS. Now getting here through and uh, Matt KPV already dive bombing again now we're side by side with Stony. Trying to get the inside here and because of, of the damage he has we are just faster than him right now and he needs to let go of the position. Um, here I make a little bit of a mistake but it isn't punished that hard. And meanwhile Marky and the dog who crashed in the beginning uh, have started to catch up but the doggy's race was yeah, kind of ruined. Not on purpose of course because uh, nobody does that on purpose when we are racing together. And then Matt KPV again dive bombing very hard there in that last corner. Meanwhile, we are chasing Kickwick, but he has uh, taken the advantage of us fighting back there and uh, just gained the lead. And uh, 28.02 is a very fast lap as well. So, uh, congrats to Kickwick for winning this round. And then we will finish maybe with the fastest lap, I don't know. Yet, we'll cross the finish line now in 27.7, so we actually take the fastest lap here. I didn't really quite remember this, so uh, that's why I hesitated. So Kickwit takes the win, Matt KPV comes in third, Stone with the damage falls back to fourth place. And Lodok and Marky who crashed in the beginning, very unfortunate, all the way back down. So I'm first now, leading with 5 points to Lodok and Kickwit came in third. So let's go to the third round. Alright, Maple Ridge. Uh, the third round here is uh, a very long track. Um, and we are just trying to defend our position, but again, we start from the back. Uh, it's a reversed grid tournament, so every race we reverse the grids. And Stone is in first. So I'm gonna have to chase Kickwick and Lodog here as we try to go safely to turn one. But the carnage here always unfolds in turn 2. Uh, that's a known fact. Uh, already there's bumping. Uh, Kickwick tries to attack. Uh, Matt KPV does what he's known for best. Uh, overtaking Marky fighting back for the position though. As Matt goes wide here. Kickwick doesn't really take advantage of that. But slightly hits the barrier there. Losing some, uh, some speed. Uh, I'm still trying here to break and just be a bit safe. Because the race is not won on the first lap, as you'll notice in this race. Now, Ledog and Kickwick too wide here. Uh, I hit Ledog here, so I break away from the pack. Uh, and still, we are fighting for these positions, and the grid is just so close together still. 
Uh, Stone is still in, in the lead. We take the outside, try to go to the old switcheroo, but it uh, doesn't quite work out. Lodok defends very well. Um, he needs to break there a bit more than me, so I can try to take the outside line here, but it just doesn't quite work out in this, uh, this corner. As we exit the last corner into turn uh, into lap three, sorry, and we still chase Lodok and Kickwick around the track. We try to take the inside, kind of too, maybe too aggressive. I don't think he has got too much damage, so he should be good. Lodok, if you hear this, I'm sorry about that. Uh, as we still try to push for some more points because. The championship can be made or lost with just one position at this point because five points difference is not so not that much. Now into lap four, Kickwick with the fastest lap, 35.2. Uh, and I just noticed that we had uh, two damage the entire race already. So uh, probably from the the hits that we took at Ladog, as Ladog goes very wide here. Let's try the old switch rule. Uh, I kinda hit him, I think. I think I pushed him forwards, but I didn't realize that during the race. I thought it just went wide. Afterwards, I was like, oh yeah, I pushed him. So uh, we overtake him. Not quite that nicely, but we still overtake him. And uh, now we can push to Kickwick, who is in fourth, maybe another point. As we take the fastest lap again, 35.03. And uh, yeah, just pushing on now to the pack again. Lodok hits the barrier there. Uh, Kickwick takes the inside of Matt KPV there actually. And uh, yeah, Matt KPV not respecting that he got overtaken and just yeah, pushing wide. Something he needs to work on. As Tony here hits the barrier. And I can actually get two positions out of that carnage. There, um, it's me, uh, Kickwick and uh, Lodok sticking together like, uh, like they're glued. And uh, so they, yeah, they bump each other and yeah Ludok and Stony both get out there pretty good though so we got second again Marky in first big congratulations to him and uh, Ludok in third still after a massive crash in the uh, last lap so I'm first Marky is in second and Ludok is in third place now they only divide by one point so now we are going to race in Tilk Sports the final track uh, again, it's a long, long race, a long track, and again, we start from last, uh, which is fine, and that's what you already noticed, I think, uh, from last races, where we already, I think we had all of all podiums, so uh, let's see what we can do this race, again, looking forward, which is very important when you start from the back. And uh, something I want to mention this race is that uh, this the current problem with uh, with penalties. So you'll notice that a couple of times we get penalties, and it's just yeah, we think that people should be ghosted, just like here. Uh, Ludok spins out Marky because of the the glue system, and uh, he gets a penalty, and then I get a penalty as well because I get just grabbed onto him, kinda. So which is really annoying, so if they ghost people will get penalties or maybe just count on the time at the end, uh, we should be good. And maybe there should be a de detection system even, and here once again uh, Marky gets a penalty, I bump him and go wide. But uh, yeah, we should get the, a kind of system that uh, detects if drivers get bumped into a barrier or just... Um, yeah, or just hit the barrier themselves or get a penalty themselves and such a system I think would really benefit the game in its current state. Uh, well, because online racing is really tedious when it comes to that. Um, again here with Stony, he gets a penalty and he has just nowhere to go. Um, I don't get a penalty here, which is uh, amazing. But yeah, we are still in fifth now, chasing down Tony and then Kickwick who is in front. Um, Marky just kind of gave up and is all the way at the back. So I think he's going for uh, fast laps. Just trying to get the fastest lap. And uh, Stony goes a bit wide here. So he gets a little bit closer again. And he's looking for the move. But doesn't kind of go for it. Because he's just too far away. He goes wide so we go 
a little bit closer again. It goes very wide here. No, we gain somewhat more speed, but again, we have damage from the crash earlier, so nothing much we can do. Um, Stony defending here, going a bit wide, get wide because he braked too late. And then, yeah, he's just faster because of the damage. Here again, a bit wide, but he's defending very well. And then here, <laughs> again, a bit wide. <laughs> Unfortunately for him, this was the last, uh, the, the final lap almost. So uh, yeah, that's uh, not the smartest idea to risk uh, going so fast there. Uh, what I also noticed is that everyone was going very wide in, this, in uh, these uh, turns here. And we're just losing a lot of time because of that. But yeah, we end up into fourth place after some... Uh, tedious racing with uh, the bollards and uh, the penalties and I really think that's and I, I think I'm not alone in this that uh, when we're talking about these penalty systems we should really get a change anyway we finish in fourth Matt KPV gets first place Kickwick is in third and I think the dog is in second yes there he is he actually is the same colors as me almost though um, and kick quick with the fastest lap here, so he gets one extra point. So we will see what that does for the standings. I think I can keep my first spot. And as Marky now just crosses the line, uh, he doesn't get the fastest lap actually, so unfortunately for him. Stony was in fifth, and the standings, I think I was first. Um, Lodok came second. Matt actually overtook Kickwick with only one point. So uh, that's that's a lot when you know uh, there's only one race left and one position can uh, really change up the, the standings. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know below what you would like to see next. And uh, yeah, enjoy the color schemes and peace out.